you don't need to be accepted. You need to accept yourself. And once you accept yourself, then you can align with people that accept themselves too. Ladies and gentlemen, there's something about this yeah. girl and from around my way. Ever try to hold back your feelings? But it just wouldn't say. title i'm going to be trying on this wig by eunice hair wigs i'm going to link it down below the first time i tried it on i was doing to get ready with me and i did a side part this is cute i think i want to curl it but, but i wasn't really feeling it at all so i'm gonna do a middle part today and yeah and i think i'm gonna curl it probably want to curl it this is gonna be super quick because i'm not gonna braid down my hair simply because i don't feel like it this week is gonna be color super cute how y'all been so y'all i've been gonna start this new thing where i talk about different topics that's been on my mind while i do my hair so one topic that's been on my mind is also i'm looking in this mirror if you see me not looking in the camera so one topic that's been on my mind is your worth is not determined by the work that you put out into the world like or what you can do for somebody like your worth is not determined by that like yours worth so much more than what you can do for the next person the amount of work you put out how much money you make like it's so much more than to you than just what you can do so that's been on my mind because i'm sure other people think about that too another thing is do not let social media rush your process. It's okay to still be figuring it out. Tomorrow might just be the day that you get it. And I feel like also, it's no end goal. Like, I mean, it's no end, like, life is a journey. Like, it's gonna be ups and downs. Like, that's just what life is. It's never just gonna be this perfect time. Like, you have to make every day the perfect time. You have to make every day fun. You have to find the joy in every day. Because you'll soon realize that the only thing that really matters is the current moment. Not tomorrow, not the future, the current moment. What can you do in this current moment to make life feel better for you? That's what That needs to be your goal every day. What am I grateful for right now? What can I change right now? What can I do right now? What can I be grateful for in this moment? When you look around you, what's something that you're grateful for right now? You know, that need to be your goal. Now I'm just fixing the clips all around. It's so simple, so easy, no breakdown. Another thing is, do not wait for other people to believe in you. It's not their job to believe in you. They're trying to figure out their own lives and try to believe in themselves. All that you need to believe in is you. The only person you need to believe in is you. And then everyone else is gonna follow after that. A big thing that I've been living by lately is only God can judge me, that's period. And that's take, that takes away a lot of shame because it's like, you cannot judge me, you are not God. You make mistakes just like the next person, you bleed just like the next person, and no one is above the other. So Y'all, this wig is ombre, so it starts off dark and it fades into lighter. So it's not just all brown. So yeah, I'm about to press it out. I'm trying to see, should I, I'm gonna press out my leave out, but I'm trying to see if I should press it out or curl it. Hmm. Yes, I'm about to go ahead and press my edges out. I just heat it up. My flat irons, another thing is you need to be yourself truly, authentically, fully, whatever that is, because you wanna make sure that you're aligning with the right people. You wanna make sure that people like you for you, for real. Like, if you faking this facade, then, What's the point? You know, what's the point of the people that like you? Cause they not they don't like the real you. So you need to stay true to yourself, stay true to what feels right for you. And don't worry about if you're doing too much. So what? So what? Maybe you need to be around people that do too much too, or that love that you do too much. You know what I'm saying? Like stop trying to change yourself to fit in i feel like once you grow up you realize life is kind of like a big high school people trying to be accepted 
and all these other things, you don't need to be accepted. You need to accept yourself. And once you accept yourself, then you can align with people that accept themselves too and that are proud of you for just being yourself. You don't have to do too much. You don't have to be extra. You can, all you gotta do is be yourself and that's just fine. You wanna make sure you're aligning with the right people, with people that get it, with people you don't have to force and beg to get it. They just get it already. You cannot be afraid to fail. If I have learned anything from art, from like really taking art seriously these past few months is, fail fail like it's okay like literally fail because you can the beautiful thing about life about waking up every day about you even watching this video right now is you have another chance at life to do it over one thing art has taught me is you can paint over something a million times and you can start new like it is not the end of the world and it, it is okay and that's one thing i wish i could tell my younger self because i used to get so frustrated when i would and, you know make art and stuff like that but i wish i could tell my younger self like it's okay like just do it over just paint over it just draw over it like it's literally that simple like you can start over every day you wake up is a new chance to start over be better do better choose better like you have the opportunity to do that that some people didn't get the opportunity to do because they didn't wake up today so take advantage of that seize the moment Seriously, seize your moment. I'm trying to see how should I curl it? I think so. I feel like you need to believe in something. I believe in God, but I don't knock anyone who doesn't or who believes in a different God, whatever. I don't care. But I just feel like you need to believe in something. You need something that you can you can just vent to, put your faith in, like a, just a good feeling and if it's not god it need to be yourself if it's not yourself i don't care if it's a tree i don't care if it's a plant a flower something you just need i just feel like you need to put your faith into something because when you're at your lo lowest you need something to just believe in that's going to keep you going every day so yeah, you just need something to put your faith in that's just a big thing because I don't know, I love God. Me personally, I love God because I just feel like, I just feel like I'm never alone. I feel like I always got somebody to talk to. Like I talk to God throughout my day so much. Now I be like, God, please just guide me. Like show me what to do, tell me what to do. Like, and I swear to God, I get the answers. I swear I get the answers. It, uh, and if you think about it, things always work out. You wouldn't be watching this video if things didn't work out for you. Just leaving your house, is big to me like anything can happen your life is always just one step away from like something totally different so i just feel like put your faith in something and it don't have to be god you know i love god i'm a big advocate for god but whatever your heart whatever feels right in your heart i feel like you need to put your faith in something that's going to give you that love and that that faith and that just encouragement that you need sometimes like i don't care what it is just put your faith in something that just feeds your soul for real but yeah um i'm trying to think what else has been on my mind what else i've been going through and dealing with um yeah, really just staying true to myself, man. Staying true to myself and what feels right for me so I can attract other people that's on that same frequency. Like, energy is so real. You ever been around a negative person and then you left them and you just felt so just drained afterwards? But have you ever been around like a random stranger or like just someone that just had really good energy and then afterwards you just feel excited about life? You feel ready to just try new things meet new people like energy is deep and that goes the same with who you share your time with who you date it all uh, it, it really does matter like it really does so just make sure that you're aware of that another thing that's been on my mind is like you can read all the books you you want to read you can learn all these things but if you're not really applying what you're learning then what's the point like the point of knowledge is to apply it and to, you know what I'm saying? Not just to know all these things, but to apply what you learn 
and then show other people too so yeah y'all um if i think of anything else i need to have my talking videos more structured out because I just be saying random things that be on my mind. But yeah, I'm just gonna finish because I'm getting hot. I'm gonna turn the fan on and just curl the rest of my hair. So I'm gonna speed up the video. But I'm liking it so far. I really am. It's cute. Curls really cute. So I'll be right back. Y'all know I can't curl for real. I'll be fake curling. <laughs> I cannot curl for anything. I really am liking this color. I was gonna so short at first, but this is super cute. And I'm in Numo. Have y'all watched Kid Cudi's new movie, Intergalactic? I am in love with that movie. I watched it like three times. The art, the music, that's all by him. Like the graphics, the story, everything. I am in love with that movie. It's on Netflix. Y'all watch it and tell me what y'all think. I really like that movie. Like it made me like even want to invest in the iPad and even more. I've been wanting the iPad, but it been making me want to just get one even more to do some art, some digital art. Like I love that movie, and it's not a kid's movie, by the way. So any kids do not watch it. <laughs> do not watch that movie. It's very rated R, very much rated R. But it's a cartoon though. The animation. Also, do y'all watch anime? I wanna get into anime somewhere. Someone told me Death Note. I've seen Spirited Away. That used to be one of my favorite movies and I never knew that it was considered anime. I didn't even know anime was just an Asian animation. I didn't know that, so. You learn something new every day. And it makes sense now. So I'm guessing Avatar The Last Airbender is considered anime too, which I love. That was my favorite like childhood show. So, but I want to get into some other ones. So, it's the real, real, you know, anime. So, definitely let me know. This hair is super soft. And it was really just going to be like some messy curls, to be honest. Nothing, nothing crazy. Just a little curl, curl here, curl, curl here. Let's see, should I put it behind my ear? Or no? Yeah, I know I cannot curl. So, I try my best. Okay. Well, okay, y'all, that's the end of this video. I tried to do like some messy curls, threw some curls in there. This hair is super soft, super cute. Like I said, I'm gonna link everything down below. So I hope you enjoy, I hope you all enjoy our little talk. And like I said, Comment down some like topics y'all want me to talk about too. Um, I have a braiding video coming sometime in November, so that'll be good. But yeah, thanks for watching.
got caught up. Spider web sex must have got caught up. But there's more to it, I remember once. Saying less on the peons. Let's go to Vegas and watch Celine Dion. Make them say what we on. You say no like you was doing it for eons. Bunk it out just home and let the watch give off the neons. When it rains, it pours. I laugh to myself when I change the score. You said my sex was a lot, but my brain gave you more. Huh? Something about how your ex was a toy.